my son is 30 years old. Uh, oldest grandson is um, just turned uh, 13. And uh, it's crazy about his dad. Uh, his dad was a very good basketball player. He's well known here. My son has been locked up for over um, four years. Um, has about two and a half, three more years to go. My oldest daughter is there, Champagne. My second oldest, the one we're talking about here. My son is uh, now 30 years old. He's been involved in the justice system for probably the last seven, six to seven years. Um, started off with uh, drug use and then the selling of uh, drugs. There's an analogy called guilty by association. And uh, I think a lot of times he, you know, aligned himself with the wrong crowd. That also played a part in is, you know, the lack of programs um, in our city, um, which continue today. Um, there's not a lot for our young men and our young women to do these days, particularly in the inner city. It's been very dif difficult for me as a father to see his son and um, his children, more importantly, being absent from that, from that growth opportunity. Part of uh, the word grandparent is, is grand, right? Um, I have to be grand right now. I have to fill in. But that's not how the cycles are supposed to work. A lot of times we judge so quickly um, that we don't look at the heart, right? Um, and we don't dig deep. We don't ask the right questions. I think that the justice system has accepted the fact that there a problem exists. Um, they're putting funding towards it. But what we are still waiting on is how that funding is going to be used and utilized. There should be opportunities, resources available to him to excel. And we are missing that piece. Um, there is a mental illness concept that we must address before we get him jobs or before we do anything else um, and introduce him or reintroduce him, if you will, to society. Now, is there some responsibility on those individuals? Absolutely, I'll be the first to tell you my son is in this situation um, for a high percentile because of his actions. Um, but I can also tell you that if he had these resources available to him, he'll be a positive member of this community and a positive member in his household where his place is as a father.